Good morning, LJH. Today is Friday, August 19th. Today, later in the show, we will be announcing our first time trivia winner. Stay tuned each week as there will be a new trivia contest announced each Tuesday with prizes from local merchants and our sponsors. Today's sponsor is the American Legion Post, number 27 of Plymouth. It's National Potato Day. Potatoes have been popular parts of diets around the world for centuries. Did you know that more than 45 billion pounds of potatoes are harvested in the U.S. each year? We use them to make baked potatoes, mashed potatoes, home fries, french fries. The list is endless. Let's begin now with our Pledge of Allegiance. We stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the moment of silence. Welcome back. Now for today's LGH News. Are you interested in acting? How about doing research or writing about current events and relevant topics? Do you like to read about stories of poetry? Are you a good thinker on your feet? Would you like to gain more confidence in speaking in public? Which is more important life skill? These are just some opportunities you have to join the Lincoln Speech Team. The call-out and informational meeting for the speech team is next Tuesday, August 23rd from 6 to 7 p.m. In, in, in the Innovation Academy Red Room here at Lincoln. You are asked to bring your computer, something to write with, and your schedule. At least one parent or guardian is asked to attend with you. If you have any questions, please contact Mrs. McKenzie in room 206. Next, let's take a look at today's weather with Kylie and Eric with Digital Storm Team Weather. Hi, this is Eric Nunez and Kylie Dalton with your weekend weather. Today will be scattered thunderstorms with a high of 81 and a low of 69. On Saturday, th there will be thunderstorms and a high of 80 and a low of 67. On Sunday, there will be scattered showers with a high of 71 and a low of 61. On Monday, it will be partly cloudy with a high of 74 and a low of 56. Our LGH Cafe is coming up next. Followed by, by Campus News with Austin and Hayden. Today's lunch is cheese pizza, green beans, butter carrots, <laughs> and fruit fries. Have a good lunch, LJH. Thanks again to our amazing cafeteria staff. Today on Campus News, we will continue our segment on new faces at Lincoln, followed by a trip to the library in the first and a fourth part storm. Watch series. But first, let's head over to Brenna and Grace and find out who the Trivia Time winner is this week. Welcome back to Trivia Time. This week, the question was, which country marches in last during the opening ceremony of the Olympics? And the correct answer was the hosting country. This year, it was Brazil. There were many close entries, but the winner is Graham Barger. You win a free coupon for a Jimmy John sub. See Mrs. Nylinger for your prize. Thank you all for participating in this week's trivia time. And make sure you tune in next week for new questions and more awesome prizes. Congratulations again to our first trivia time winner of the year, Graham Barger. Now let's get started with our new campus news segment featuring our new faces of Lincoln and take a trip to the library for our 40 Amazing Books segment. Lincoln. This is Kylie Kalendrus from Storm TV. Today we are looking at some new faces at Lincoln. Let's meet our new family. I mean, it was really scary to me, but I mean, I 
I can talk about it just fine now. So I had lost control. <laughs> How are you doing? Lincoln. I'm Abby and I'm with Storm TV. Today we thought about how we have the 40 book challenge in humanity so I thought I would show you some highlights of these really good series that we have. It's the Tellerman Cycle and the Strange but True Stories and they're really good books so you should check them out and they will all go towards your 40 books. Leo Tanner, here now. Where's your homework? Uh, my turkey gobbled it up. <laughs> is that a dumb joke or is that the real reason why you didn't turn it in? That's true. Well, that is a dumb turkey. <laughs> hey, favorite students, how are you go? Uh, Kendall, where is your homework? Uh, my pet shark eat it. Your pet shark? Yeah, his name's Johnny. It's a terrible name for a shark. And he ate your homework. Hey, did you get your homework done in class today? I did get my homework done in class today. Did you? Yeah. That's good. Be responsible, kids! Next, let's head over to our sports team, Daniel and Drew, for an update on LJH Sports, the Olympics, and, and sports at the national level. Football teams are having their first game against Logan Sports. Seventh graders start at 12, 8th at 1.30. Now back to Emma and Hayden with Campus News. Tuesday, we'll continue with our new faces at Lincoln segments, review how to be safe at LGH, introduce our trivia time for the week, see what Mrs. Deerfield students are creating, and more. That's all we have for today. We will be back on Tuesday with more LGH news, weather, and sports. But before we sign off, remember our words of wisdom for today. I will act as if what I do makes a difference. Make it a great day or not. The choice is yours.